What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Duck Koala coming at you guys with another hooked video. We are here with part three of Lights Please. If you guys haven't checked out the previous videos or the previous episodes, make sure you guys go do that. The links will be in the description down below. And if you guys haven't checked out my other series, check out the description as well. I have links to all my other series and everything as well. Now you guys absolutely killed it on the last video. I asked for 300 likes and you guys destroyed that. So we're going to go ahead and ask for another 300 likes on this video so that way I can get part four and the final part out of this story for you guys now I know you guys are really excited last time we left off this story kind of took a twist and uh, yeah so we're gonna find out what happens so this is part three of lights please I hope you guys enjoy if you're new to the channel remember to subscribe for more daily content make sure you click on the little notification bell as well so that way you never miss whenever I upload a video but with all that to the side let's go ahead and get into this this is part three of lights please I'll go in first are you sure yes once I find Tasha, I'll signal you. If he finds out you're here, he might try and hurt her. Don't hesitate to call us. We have backup. Deal. You here, my love? I'm here. Good. Your daughter is waiting for you. She misses you so much. It's quite endearing. You animal. Now that's no way to respond to your husband. Where are you? Come on in. Todd, just tell me where you are. And take the fun out of it? You have to come find us. It'll be fun. I've set up your type of scavenger hunt. I'm not playing this stupid game. Come on. You know how much Tasha loves hide and seek. Where do I go first? Walk in the house, silly. Okay. See you soon. Holy crap, what the heck, Todd? A freaking axe swung down as I opened the door. Really? I think it nicked my forehead. Oh yeah, forgot to mention. There are certain uh, surprises in store for you. I'm not doing this. Do you want to see your daughter again or not? I might not see her if I die first. You okay? We heard a scream. I'm fine. Should I call in the units? No, not yet. I'm not sure where he is. Just wait, I'll contact you. Where do I go next? Look around. Is that... Blood? What have you done, Todd? It's not hers. Follow the arrows up the stairs. You mean the bloody arrows? I think they're works of art. Took me forever to make them. Okay, I'm at the top of the stairs. God, it reeks. Wait, is that? Holy crap. The far door where my studio used to be. Go to it. The door, it's painted red. Is that blood too? Red always has been my favorite color. Whose is it, Todd? Where is my daughter? You're a maniac. That hurts. Do you really think I'd kill my own daughter, our daughter? I just want to be with her. That's what this is all about. Be with her. And you. God, did you go in? Who is that? Remember Daryl? The neighbor? Lives in the blue house across the street? Don't act like you don't know him. Uh, this is where the stench is coming from? You two were always so friendly. Are you kidding? We maybe interacted twice, ever. But I saw how he looked at you. I don't know what you're talking about. The way he smiled every time you passed his house. He was just being a kind neighbor. That's what neighbors do. And for that he gets his gut spread all over the place? His blood painted on the walls? Crossing the line if you ask me. So I'd figure I'd combine your two favorite things. What are you talking about? Painting. And Daryl. Todd, you need help. 
Wow, that's your response to a man who just wants to care for you? For your daughter? Where is she? This can end now if you bring her out and just disappear. If you can do that, I will forget any of this ever happened. But then we'll be back in the same place from where we started. My family will be gone? I just want my daughter. I didn't come here for you. I came here for Tasha. I'm willing to help you escape if you just grant me that request. Escape from what? I came here with the police. What? Calm down. I'm the only one in the house at the moment. And they don't know that you're in here. They are waiting for me to contact them to come in. But I can help you get out of here. If you promise to give my daughter back and leave us alone. No prison. No punishment. Just flee. You promise? You have my word. Fair. Okay. We're in the attic. Really? Yes. Pull down the stairs and climb up. We are in here. Oh god, thank you, Todd. Thank you. They're in the attic. You sure? He just told me. The entrance is above the studio. Okay, stay put. We're coming. Make sure Tasha isn't hurt. We'll get the girl. Don't worry. If you kill him, I don't care. No one is here. What? There is nothing up here but old furniture and a camera. Holy crap. And a... A what? A bloodied finger. Tisk tisk, Carol. Why would you lie to me? I knew from the beginning that you weren't alone. Where are you, Todd? You just buried yourself deeper in lies. Where is my daughter? I gave you a piece of her. What? The finger. How dare you? It's your fault. You started this. Now what do I do? I can't trust you anymore. Is she safe? She's perfectly fine. Didn't need the finger anyway. But I will take something she does need if you do this again. What do you want from me? I'll give you one more chance. Because I really do want to be with you and I love you. I don't know what to say. I will tell you where we are, for real this time. But, I'll know if you come alone or not. If not, I will not hesitate to take more of your daughter. I promise I'll come alone, just please don't hurt her. 2285 Duckworth Drive. I repeat, come alone. Okay, so basically, I kind of called it. I knew this dude was going to be psycho crazy. I knew he was going to hurt her. I just freaking knew it, dude. Okay, so our girl Tasha currently is missing a finger and our girl Carol is like just like losing her freaking mind because her wacko husband abducted her daughter. There's a finger. There's like a dead neighbor with blood all over the place. Things are going sideways. But if you guys want to see the rest of the story and you want to find out what happens, make sure you guys leave a like down below. Remember, if we can hit 300 likes, I will release part four and the final part for you guys. And if you actually made it to this part of the video, you should have already seen parts one and two. But if you haven't, make sure you guys check out the links in the description down below. Remember to subscribe to the channel by clicking on that little koala logo right there. And if you guys want to check out the other little videos that I have right there, I would definitely appreciate it. Once again, links to all my other series are in the description down below. But once again, guys, thank you so much for tuning in to another koala video. This has been your boy, Duck Koala. Peace out.